On this week's Summoner Showcase Revival, the Age of League is upon us. We're showing off the work of 120 artists, things get spooky one more time, and things get really fluffy. Welcome to another episode of Summoner Showcase Revival, the show that takes your amazing artistic talents and puts them on display for the entire League of Legends community. If you're a Marvel fan like me, your head probably exploded when you saw the Age of Ultron trailer. Seeing as it has a ludicrous 55 million views, I'd say it's been fairly successful. And that means lots of parodies, recuts, mashups, whatever you want to call them. And here's the League of Legends version. I'm gonna show you something beautiful. Everyone screaming for mercy. You want to protect the world, but you don't want it to change. You're all puppets. Tangled in strings. The editing with James Spader's voice and the League cinematic clips synced up nicely. It would be easy to just play the Ultron trailer over any old League videos, but that is definitely not what Spark TV did here. And talk about good timing, with Riot releasing that Halloween puppet show video a few days after Pinocchio. I mean Ultron. That was done by Spark TV on YouTube, and you can follow the link below to watch it in its entirety. Next up, a public service announcement from Ian Rankin on Reddit, who I'm assuming isn't the famous Scottish author of the same name, but I could be wrong. Either way, he turned us on to a Tumblr page full of work from over 120 different artists, all made in celebration of the World Championships. Ian was sad that it wasn't getting as much attention as it deserved, and looking at it, we completely agree. You'll see work we've featured recently, as well as new exclusive art you won't find anywhere else. It's an awesome Tumblr made for a great reason, and I guarantee you'll find a bunch of artists you want to follow. Head on over to lolltribute.tumblr.com or follow the link below to check out a truly amazing display of community talent. We've got one more spooky video before we forget about Halloween for another year. Do you guys remember when Elise released two years ago? She had one of the best login screens ever with an equally amazing monologue. Well, Dippin' on YouTube took that old speech, added some music from Gavin Luke, and took a stroll around the twisted tree line. The result is more impressive than it might sound, so check it out. The Shadow Isles. They say they don't exist. Mythical islands haunted by ghosts and specters. Tales to frighten children. But I know better. I have been there. When I first set foot there, I immediately knew something was wrong with that place. My skin crawled, and in the pit of my stomach, I felt a terrible revulsion. Elise is such a cool character, it almost makes me feel bad that she's been nerfed into a cocoon bot. Almost. I wasn't sure what to expect coming into that video from Dippin, but damn! The original voiceover is legit, the music was a good addition, and those killer in-game shots? How do you even do that? Absolutely gorgeous. Make sure you follow the link below to watch the whole thing, and then go pester Riot for more voiceovers like that. Brace yourselves for cuteness overload! Are you ready? Okay, editing magic, go. Wait, no, that's just creepy. Can we try again? Oh my god, is that a hell beast? No, I wanted cute! One more time! There we go. Look at that adorable little 3D printed Poro. This lovely design was made by Squibbler on Reddit, and if you have a 3D printer of your own, you can PM him for the digital plans. Alternatively, you can head on over to Squibbler's Shapeways store and buy an actual printed Poro. Just follow the link below and check it out. I want to take a quick second to thank this week's sponsor, World of Tanks. It's a really fun game and it's not remotely pay to win. Everything can be unlocked by playing the game, keeping everyone on the same competitive playing field. There's absolutely no risk in trying World of Tanks, so head on over to gboffer.com tanks and check it out today. Following that link and checking out the game is also just a great way to support us and help us continue to make shows like Summoner Showcase Revival. Once again, to check out World of Tanks and support this content, 
head on over to gboffer.com slash tanks and have a blast. That's all for this week's Summoner Showcase Revival. Thank you guys so much for watching. For more video game news and content, head on over to gamebreaker.tv. We hope you enjoy our shows, and by liking and subscribing, it really helps support us. And of course, we really appreciate you telling your friends about the show. So until next time, Summoners, I'm Kat Andresco, and I'll see you guys next week. Game Breaker TV.